Hello, my name is Pascal Barnes and I'm the current chair of Exarch. For those of you not already familiar with Exarch, our nonprofit organization has been around since 2001 and has grown from very humble beginnings into the organization that we are today, a vibrant, dynamic, growing international cultural heritage network with over 350 members in over 40 countries. Our mission is to make the archeological past widely accessible. And this includes facilitating both research and education. Exarch has four legs, ancient and traditional technology, experimental archeology, span museum practice, interpretation and education. Exarch has four target groups, museums, higher education centers, organizations and individuals who are working in the fields connected with our four legs. I'm very proud to say that Exarch is an inclusive organization. We are a great example of how a society based in academic research has opened itself to a diverse range of members, from professors of archeology span to professional craftspeople, from historical interpreters to students of experimental archeology. span We are active within the world of museums as an affiliated organization with ICOM, the International Council of Museums, and as a member of NEMO, the network of European museum organizations. Exarch connects people. We organize several cooperation projects, such as our fellowship with the Colonial Williamsburg Foundation, our own twinning program, and we collaborate on various EU projects. We host a variety of national and international events including experimental archaeology conferences and specifically themed meetings, which brings me to the reason why we have all gathered here virtually today. It is my great pleasure to welcome you all to this online conference focusing on the specific topic of documentation strategies in archaeological open air museums. This two day event hosted by Exarch and the Museum Dorf Dudbel in Berlin has become our first online event and it replaces our previously scheduled meeting in Berlin on the 26th and 27th of March 2020. Like our hosts in Berlin, I was looking forward to seeing many of my XR colleagues and meeting new ones in person. But we must be pragmatic in the face of this coronavirus pandemic. Exarc joins many other organizations looking to the internet as the best way in which to interact with one another. And while born of necessity, this opportunity provides us with a new way in which to communicate with one another. And through open access, the possibility to reach an even broader audience than previously imagined. So this together with the fact that we are reducing our carbon footprint is actually quite exciting. Unfortunately, what it does not allow for is the magical first-hand experience of the archaeological open-air museum in Dupel. But I'm sure that my colleague, Dr. Julia Heap, will give you a fantastic virtual tour. Having previously worked for an archaeological open-air museum and an education center, I am genuinely interested in the subject of documentation strategies for archaeological open-air museums. The fact is that we are gathered here today because we all agree that there is a wealth of information, both tangible and intangible, that is contained in our museums and which is at risk of being lost if we don't make a concerted effort to preserve and protect it. But how do we extract and share this information? Where do we start? What tools are already at our disposal and what new tools are being developed? Over the course of the next two days, we will be joined by a range of experts ready to share practical strategies and methodologies from across the globe with the aim of unlocking and preserving the very essence of our museums to further research, education, and for the enjoyment of future generations of visitors. In order to participate in this conference, please visit our website and take time to comment and interact. We can be found at exarc.net forward slash meetings forward slash Berlin. I would like to take this opportunity to thank all of the expert participants from across Europe, the UK, Scandinavia, Africa, Saudi Arabia, Australia, America, and our keynote speaker from Japan for providing video presentations in order to allow this virtual conference to take place. The last minute changes to the format of this conference have meant a lot of additional work for the organizers. 
and I would like to extend very special thanks to the people behind the scenes. Our director, Dr. Roland Parter Cooper, and Magdalena Zelinska, our designer and administrator, and the very special team of volunteers recruited to bring you this conference. I would also like to thank Dr. Julia Hebe and her team from the Museum Dorf Dupel in Berlin, who had everything so well organized for our visit in Germany. I imagine that I am not alone in hoping that we will be able to visit your museum in the not too distant future. I hope that you will find this conference interesting and thought provoking, and ultimately that it will provide you with useful contacts, tools and insights for the continued development of your museums. Please keep following Exarch on our website and on social media and share our news. If you would like to join us as a new member or support us by making a donation by our PayPal account, we would be most grateful. Please enjoy the conference. Thank you.